Newborn rhesus monkeys will grow up not in accordance with nature, but in the controlled atmosphere of a laboratory, where all the psychological influences of childhood can be duplicated. In a classic continuing study, infant monkeys are removed from the mother at birth and raised in semi-isolation. Other individuals can be seen and heard, but there is no physical contact, no interaction. Mother is a bit of plastic and shaggy cloth, a doll with no life of its own, but capable of nourishing the life of an infant. The monkey will come to depend upon this doll to satisfy basic necessities of life. Not only nourishment, but a deeper psychological need for comfort and security. In primate infants, there is an instinctive need to cling to another body, soft and warm. Food or security, which is motherhood's stronger appeal? Alongside a warm, familiar mother of cloth is a stock wire doll set up as nothing more than a feeding machine. The young monkey is placed deliberately on a cloth mother which has no milk to nourish him, but fulfills some fundamental needs. This experiment revolves around one simple question. Will the infant monkey switch his affection to a wire mother which offers food and life itself? Forced by hunger, does he loosen his grip and begin to yield to nature's most powerful internal drive. From the wire mother, he derives one thing, nourishment. No warmth, no comfort, no feeling of security. After feeding, he returns to spend up to 22 hours a day near the only mother he knows. From this inanimate object, the infant derives all the security and mother love he needs. He can, if also exposed early to other young, grow into a normal, well-adjusted adult. <laughs>